guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to give you a really quick Aldi grocery haul of all the things I just picked up from Aldi. This week I ended up just really getting food and a few things to set up for Adrian's birthday party which is coming up this weekend. Um, I didn't really have to get any cleaning products or anything like that because I was up to date on all of that stuff. So I really hope you enjoy watching this quick Aldi haul. There's definitely some new things in here that I've tried that I really really love. If you've been been following me for a while then you know that I've been doing all of my shopping at Aldi as much as I can. There are some things at Aldi that I don't like that I have still been popping to Coles which is just up the road from my house um, to get. For example salmon I always get from Coles. There's some gluten-free products like gluten-free pita bread um, and then some baby things like baby mum mums. Um, what else? Rasks and things that you can't get from Aldi for babies that I have been still getting from Coles. But this is my Aldi grocery haul. I really hope that you enjoy. Let me know in the comment section down below if you like this video, if you love seeing my hauls or if you find them boring because they're quite similar. Um, just so I know and I can keep doing them every so often if you are enjoying them. But let's get right into it. Okay, so I spent $193.46 sets. I got all of this which I think is pretty good. Normally I spend about $200 but that includes all my like toilet paper and cleaning products as well which I didn't need this time but I did get heaps of stuff for his party so let me show you. Fresh food I always get chopped kale and baby spinach. I got sweet potatoes, cucumber, lemons and limes, um, broccolini, and I said this in my last one, but these bags from Aldi you reuse. They say, please reuse me, so if you just keep them aside and you can always use them for your fresh fruit and veggies. Mushrooms, um, zucchinis, little tomatoes, and strawberries. Got all this fruit. We eat so many bananas, so I like to get some of different colors, so I get like yellow ones that are already and then I try and get some green ones that will take a while to go ripe. Um, apples, cheese for the kids, Zara loves these cheese sticks and I also got some normal cheese because we've been making a lot of like homemade pizzas on little mini muffins for the kids so I thought that would be a good idea or to um, toasted sandwiches. This is something I wanted to show you that is one of my new favorites. This coconut lemongrass and chili rice. It is amazing. We have been having it and mixing it with spinach and then cooked salmon on top. And it is so good and so quick and easy to cook. The quinoa is something I found that Adrian really likes. Adrian is one, turning one this week. He loves it. He will eat it. I'll make it like a fried rice, um, but instead of rice, use the quinoa, and he absolutely loves it. And then, of course, we got our normal brown rice and quinoa, which we just have in like a um, burrito bowl or a salad bowl or something like that. This pizza I like to put in the freezer just for those nights where maybe I'm going out for dinner and Simon will be with the kids and he can just quickly have that. I got turkey mints um, to make bolognese sauce. I find that the kids like it much better if it's the turkey mints. Um, garlic prawns, these are the best. I normally cook them up without adding the garlic butter. I find that there's enough flavor without that. The cocktail franklets are for Adrian's birthday party. I'm gonna be making mini hot dogs for the kids. There's about 25 kids coming, oh my goodness. Um, so I got the cocktail frankfurts and then I'm gonna use these uh, little rolls which I'll heat up in the oven and make mini hot dogs for them. So I hope that works. <laughs> the dips, I got some dips for the party as well. I love this dip. This is one of my favorite dips from Aldi but they never have it so I stocked up. It's just a rocket and pesto hummus. The ingredients you'll see it doesn't have any I love this because it doesn't have any dairy in it. So it's just chickpeas, water, oil, tahini, almonds, garlic basil, rocket. You know, I mean, it does have preservatives and stuff in it. But for me, it's great that it doesn't have any dairy in it. So I love that one. And then normal hummus. And this is Simon's favorite one at the moment. So I get that for him. Then we got these gluten-free buckwheat pasta spirals. These are the best. I love these for Adrian as well. I find that when he's eating this type of spiralized pasta, it's so much easier for him to grasp onto the pasta almost because it's spiralized. So that's what we use for the kids' pasta. 
vanilla cake mixes. This is for his birthday cake. If you want to make a really tall cake, you need two cake mixes. So you make two cakes and split each of them in half. So you have like four layers and it ends up being a really tall cake. So that's what I'm making. I'm making like a naked cake for his birthday. Um, I just need to get a small tin because I want it to be kind of like smaller than a regular cake size and a bit taller. Wholemeal bread for sandwiches and toast. These muffins, Zara is loving muffins for breakfast with peanut butter and banana on them. Or as I said, we make mini pizzas sometimes for dinner. Maple syrup, I had run out. I love getting maple syrup from Aldi. It's that little bit cheaper. Turmeric, I had run out. I love making turmeric sweet potatoes, yum. Pasta sauce, I always stock up on this. Panadol, cause you know, we all have colds. Chocolate, that's Simon's favorite chocolate. Tissues, cause we're all sick. Wheat bix, and yes, I know you can get the huge big box. I wish I could, I just can't fit it in my tiny, tiny pantry. These are my fave little things for healthy. I love snacking on this um, toasted flakes with sea salt after dinner as like a after dinner snack or mixing it with frozen berries that's my fave for like after dinner snack desiccated coconut i mix into smoothies and chia seeds for smoothies they're all the rolls for the hot dogs um, corn chips great for lunch boxes and i just snack on these in the afternoon eggs and then all of our drinks coconut milk um, coconut water and almond milk we're using smoothies and coffee um, what's this mineral water I got two of the almond spreads because I use this in smoothies and on toast sometimes and tomato sauce that's for the little hot dogs. So guys, that is my Aldi grocery haul this time. I really hope you enjoyed it and you picked up some new things that you can possibly buy from Aldi to add to your weekly list to add in some healthy foods. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you're new so you don't miss a video. I make videos about health, wellness, mum life, just my real everyday life, you guys. I just wanna share what's actually going on, not filtered, and I really hope you enjoy. And I'd love you to comment and say hi, and I'll definitely see you in my next video. Bye, guys.